last 10 years, we've really, we've really focused on being in three areas, and that's welding, assembly work, and material handling. Our mechanical designers, our robot programmers, our controls designers, everyone's involved in the process from the beginning. So everybody, including myself, and all the managers in the company, are, they're hands-on, they're involved in the job. And that's involved in the job internally, involved in the job with the customer. So when we take on a challenging project, it's, it's everybody's input into the process. Our abilities within in-house to be able to manufacture, to fabricate, to machine, our own componentry uh, allows us to be able to respond to project needs as they come along, to be timely, to meet the project schedules, and to control our own standard of quality. It's fun from an engineering standpoint because it's not cookie cutter, it's not the same as you did the last time. It, require, it allows us, I guess you would say, to stretch our legs. We had uh, the opportunity to take an entirely manual process, one that was dirty, dangerous, and difficult, uh, and turn that into an automated process that gave a dramatic increase in cycle time, provided a much safer environment, and gave control for the process that didn't exist before. And it was satisfying to tackle something that you know nobody's been really anxious to do, and it's hard and it's scary, but you've done it, and it, it's very successful. I get texts. I got one last week, a guy just texted me out of nowhere to tell me how well it was going. And that just doesn't happen. Customers don't call you to tell you how things are awesome. You know, so that's been, that was very satisfying. We learn our customers' needs. We learn about what's important to them. And then we can go above and beyond just the pieces of paper that give us a design and go to the design intent that really meets the need of the customer. Um, and, and maybe something that's a little out of uh, the ordinary, but really brings the, the end result of a successful project for them. It's been a case of the companies have never had automation, and we try to strive to help them understand the needs of automation, as well as the benefit of it. Initially, customers pick Trantec because of our experience and what we can show them that we've been able to do. They come back because of the experience they had when when we did that first project for them. That's, that's a real strength of Trantec because we've maintained our base of people, uh, people that have worked multiple projects for the same customer. We try to maintain continuity where we can uh, when we're doing repeat work with customers. And, and that's something that, that um, I think is special about this organization. They see the responsiveness, they see the dedication from Trantec to make things right on their floor. Um, they see the dedication of the team members here to, you know, work as a whole to produce a final product. The customer was, yes, it was successful, yes, it was on time, but what they really enjoyed was working with our people. That, that's a core principle for us, is that we want to be somebody people want to work with. I think that's probably the most important thing.